The first founding value of South Africa's constitution is quite a revolutionary one. It's a belief that every single human being has dignity and that dignity is inherent. It's something that's our birthright. I think I was very aware about injustice from a very early age. I wanted to end poverty by the time I was 40 years old and I wanted to reach Nirvana by the time I was 60 years old. <laughs> There are many, many women who instinctively understand that the way in which girls and boys are pigeonholed is wrong. The gender stereotypes constrain our freedom to be fully human. Parliament was very much a male institution. On the floor I was on, there were no women's toilets. There were two sets of toilets. Both had a sign up saying men. And I remember just taking a piece of paper and writing women and sticking it over one of them. <laughs> Craig's governor is a woman who's just so calm and so peaceful, but she has this steely strength that is unyielding. I work on the rights to water and sanitation over the last while, and it's probably you know, the most basic rights. People often say, well, why aren't we solving this problem? So you can't solve the problem of water if you don't look at who is using most of South Africa's water, which is industry, who pollutes most of South Africa's water, industry, and that it's industry that wastes most of South Africa's water. Political systems, economic systems, and social systems have resulted in such poverty and inequality globally and in our country. They tend to be premised on nurturing the worst of human nature, that human beings will do anything to step on each other to get to the top. And I think that people want things to change. That's it, beautiful, and hold that pose. Many of us believe in the same goal of listening to those voices who can so easily be silenced, ensuring that people attain their human rights that are enshrined in the Constitution. Let's try again. One, two, three. The, the portrait was all about her balance and her serenity, and there's Priggs standing there, serene, strong, exactly the energy that I experienced with her, the human being. The ability of each of us is also enriched by each other. The best collectives come when you have strength in each person in that collective. We have to focus on how we can use our power in a united way.